how to make your own frozen dinners. Creating your own TV dinners is easy and economical. These guidelines will help get you started. You will need foods that freeze well, reheatable plates, sauce, gravy, oil, or butter, a dessert, freezer-safe plastic wrap, heavy-duty aluminum foil, labels, and a microwave-safe plastic dome or paper towels. Optional, frozen vegetables. Step 1. Know which cooked foods freeze well. Rice, pasta and bean dishes, stews, roasted, baked or broiled meat and poultry, and vegetables all reheat nicely. Cooked fish can be frozen, but defrosting and reheating may affect the texture. Don't freeze fried foods, which can turn rancid when warmed up. If you're preparing pasta, rice or vegetables specifically for frozen dinners, undercook them a bit. Step 2. Use the proper container. If you plan to microwave the meal, arrange the leftovers on a sturdy paper plate or microwavable dish. For oven heating, use an aluminum dish. Don't mound food higher than an inch and a half or it won't reheat evenly. If your vegetables are well cooked, save them for soup and use frozen veggies topped with a pat of butter instead. Step 3. Spoon a little sauce, gravy, oil, or butter on the food to help prevent freezer burn and keep it moist. If you're using a sectioned plate, add a dessert. Sliced cake, cupcakes, and cookies freeze and defrost well. Step 4. Let food cool before covering the plate with freezer-safe plastic wrap, forcing out as much air as possible. Then, wrap it tightly with a couple of layers of heavy-duty aluminum foil, sealing the edges tightly. Step 5. Label the meal with contents and date before putting it in the freezer, where it will stay good up to four months. Step 6. To reheat, remove the wrapping. If using a microwave, cover with a plastic dome or paper towels, with a corner tucked back to allow steam to be released. Nuke on defrost for about eight minutes, and then on high for three to five. If reheating in the oven, cover with foil and bake at 350 degrees for 25 minutes, then uncover and bake for another 10 minutes. Step 7. Enjoy your homemade TV dinner, and keep experimenting until you have a few go-to frozen meals down to a science. Did you know? Frozen meals were first sold to consumers in 1949 under the One-Eyed Eskimo label, and were only sold in the Pittsburgh area.